Imagine our planet, Earth, cloaked in a sheet of ice. This isn't the plot of a science fiction film, but a scientific theory known as Snowball Earth. This theory suggests that, during various periods in Earth's history, our planet was completely or nearly completely covered in ice. These intense ice ages lasting millions of years transformed Earth into a frigid, desolate world. The Snowball Earth hypothesis is a fascinating and controversial idea. It challenges our perceptions of Earth's climate and its ability to change. The thought of our warm, life-sustaining planet transformed into a giant snowball is a stark reminder of the power and unpredictability of nature. Evidence for these dramatic events lies buried deep within the Earth itself. Geologists, like detectives at a crime scene, piece together clues from ancient rocks scattered across the globe. These rocks hold within their very structure the secrets of a time when ice ruled supreme. The Snowball Earth theory is more than just an intriguing idea, it is a reminder of the delicate balance that sustains life on Earth. Understanding the causes and consequences of these global glaciations can provide valuable insights into the complex workings of our planet's climate system. Rocks, silent witnesses to time, hold the key to unlocking the secrets of Earth's frozen past. One of the most compelling pieces of evidence for the Snowball Earth theory comes from the presence of glacial deposits, such as tillites and dropstones, in areas that were once located near the equator. These geological formations are clear indicators of glacial activity, suggesting that ice sheets once extended far beyond their usual polar confines. Further support comes from the study of paleomagnetism, which analyzes the magnetic signatures preserved in rocks. These signatures reveal the latitude at which the rocks were formed. Scientists have found glacial deposits with magnetic signatures indicating formation near the equator, strengthening the case for a globally glaciated Earth. The chemical composition of rocks also provides valuable clues. During snowball Earth events, the formation of ice sheets would have locked away vast amounts of water causing changes in the chemistry of the oceans. These changes are reflected in the composition of rocks formed during these periods. By carefully piecing together the evidence from these geological records, scientists have started to paint a clearer picture of Earth's frozen past. These rocks, like pages in a history book, tell a tale of a time when ice held dominion over our planet. What could have caused our planet to plunge into such extreme icehouse conditions? Scientists believe that a confluence of factors contributed to these dramatic climate shifts. One prominent theory points to a decrease in the amount of solar radiation reaching Earth's surface. Volcanic activity may have played a role in reducing solar radiation. Large-scale volcanic eruptions can spew massive amounts of ash and sulfur dioxide into the atmosphere, forming aerosols that reflect sunlight back into space. This reduction in solar energy can trigger a global cooling effect. Another contributing factor may have been the position of the continents. Continental drift, the slow movement of Earth's tectonic plates, can significantly influence ocean currents and global climate patterns. Certain continental configurations may have disrupted ocean circulation, leading to a decrease in the transport of heat from the tropics to the poles. Once the planet started to cool, a positive feedback loop likely kicked in, accelerating the glaciation process. As ice sheets grew, they reflected more sunlight back into space, further reducing Earth's temperature and leading to the expansion of ice cover. The Snowball Earth events presented a formidable challenge to life on Earth. With most, if not all, of the planet's surface frozen, life would have been confined to isolated pockets of warmth and liquid water. These refuges might have included hydrothermal vents, areas of volcanic activity on the ocean floor, and regions where thin ice or small areas of open water persisted. Organisms that could survive in these extreme conditions would have needed remarkable adaptations. Some microorganisms might have possessed antifreeze proteins which prevent the formation of ice crystals in their cells. Others might have relied on chemosynthesis, a process that derives energy from chemical reactions rather than sunlight to survive. The fossil record from these periods is sparse, but tantalizing clues suggest that life found a way to persevere. The discovery of fossilized stromatolites, layered structures formed by communities of microorganisms in rocks dating back to the snowball earth periods, indicates that life not only survived, but may have even thrived in these challenging environments. The resilience of life during these extreme glaciations is a testament to its remarkable adaptability. 
These periods of environmental hardship may have even spurred evolutionary innovations, shaping the trajectory of life on Earth. Imagine a world where the sun appears as a dim orb in a sky perpetually overcast with ice crystals. The air is frigid, biting with a cold that chills to the bone. This was Earth during the Snowball Earth events, where ice sheets, some possibly miles thick, extended from the poles to the equator, encasing the planet in a frozen grip. Oceans, now hidden beneath a thick layer of ice, would have been plunged into darkness. The once vibrant ecosystems would have been decimated, with only the hardiest of organisms clinging to survival in the few remaining pockets of liquid water. The surface of the Earth would have been a desolate wasteland, a stark contrast to the teeming life that characterizes our planet today. Volcanoes however continued to erupt, spewing forth molten rock and gases. These eruptions, while contributing to the initial cooling, may have also played a crucial role in Earth's eventual thaw. The gases released during eruptions such as carbon dioxide would have accumulated in the atmosphere slowly warming the planet. The Snowball Earth events were periods of unimaginable environmental upheaval, testing the limits of life on Earth. Yet even in the face of such adversity, life found a way to endure, setting the stage for its eventual resurgence. The same forces that plunged Earth into a deep freeze eventually contributed to its thaw. Volcanic eruptions, which initially released sunlight-blocking aerosols, also pumped vast amounts of greenhouse gases, primarily carbon dioxide, into the atmosphere. Over millions of years these gases accumulated, trapping heat and gradually warming the planet. As temperatures rose the ice began to melt, exposing dark ocean water, which absorbed more solar radiation than the reflective ice. This process created a positive feedback loop, with increasing temperatures leading to more ice melt and further warming. The once frozen earth began to stir. The melting ice caps released torrents of fresh water into the oceans, altering their salinity and circulation patterns. These changes, combined with the influx of nutrients from weathered rocks, created a surge in biological productivity, fueling the growth of marine life. The thawing of the snowball earth was a gradual process, unfolding over millennia. As the planet warmed, life began to reclaim its dominance, diversifying and evolving to fill the newly available ecological niches. The frozen grip of the ice had finally loosened, paving the way for the resurgence of a vibrant biosphere. The Snowball Earth events, while devastating, may have paradoxically paved the way for the evolution of complex life. The extreme environmental pressures of these ice ages likely acted as a selective force, favoring organisms with adaptations that allowed them to survive in harsh conditions. The isolation of populations in scattered refuges during the glaciations may have accelerated evolution. With limited gene flow between these isolated groups, genetic differences would have accumulated more rapidly, potentially leading to the emergence of new species. The increase in oxygen levels following the Snowball Earth events is thought to have played a crucial role in the evolution of larger, more complex organisms. Oxygen is essential for aerobic respiration, a more efficient energy-producing process than anaerobic respiration. The rise of oxygen provided the metabolic machinery for the development of more sophisticated life forms. The Snowball Earth events, while representing a period of extreme hardship, may have ultimately served as a crucible for life, driving innovation and shaping the course of evolution. These ancient glaciations offer a glimpse into the remarkable resilience of life and its capacity to adapt and thrive even in the face of extraordinary challenges. The Snowball Earth events, though distant in time, hold valuable lessons for us today. They serve as a stark reminder of the dynamic nature of Earth's climate and its susceptibility to change. Understanding the factors that triggered these extreme climate shifts can provide insights into the potential consequences of current climate change. The study of past climate change, known as paleoclimatology, allows scientists to reconstruct Earth's climatic history and identify patterns and trends. By analyzing ice cores, ocean sediments, and other geological records, scientists can piece together a detailed picture of past climates and the factors that influenced them. The Snowball Earth events highlight the interconnectedness of Earth's systems. Changes in solar radiation, volcanic activity, continental configurations, and atmospheric composition can all have profound impacts on global climate. Understanding these complex interactions is crucial for predicting and mitigating the effects of future climate change. By studying the echoes of Earth's frozen past, 
we gain a deeper appreciation for the delicate balance that sustains life on our planet. This knowledge empowers us to make informed decisions to protect our planet for future generations. We are currently living in a period of rapid climate change, driven primarily by human activities such as the burning of fossil fuels. The lessons learned from the Snowball Earth events remind us that Earth's climate is not static. It has undergone dramatic shifts in the past, and human actions are now driving significant changes. The rate of current warming exceeds anything observed in the geological record, raising concerns about the potential consequences for ecosystems and human societies. The melting of glaciers and ice sheets, rising sea levels and more frequent extreme weather events are all indicators of a changing climate. The Snowball Earth events, while representing an extreme example of climate change, underscore the importance of understanding and addressing current climate challenges. By reducing greenhouse gas emissions, investing in renewable energy sources, and adopting sustainable practices, we can mitigate the impacts of climate change and create a more sustainable future. The choices we make today will determine the course of Earth's climate for generations to come. By heeding the lessons of the past and taking action to address current challenges, we can help ensure a habitable and thriving planet for all.